Hi there, my name is Nether Yam, and today we're playing Subnautica. Welcome back, everybody. I hope you're having a great day. When we last left off, ah, we were doing a whole bunch of stuff. Um, <laughs> we did a little exploring into some of the deeper parts of the world, and I realized as we went down and found ourselves some ion cubes real, real, real deep down there uh, that I had not had ion cubes yet, uh, which means that we sort of... Kind of let me, it kind of sort of reminded me that I skipped a little bit of <laughs> stuff, which, I mean, obviously, we all know this. We've been, we've all been watching the same playthrough. Um, so let us go and do a little, a couple of things that maybe we should do um, to progress into the game a little bit farther. Um, I'm going to, I want to put, I think, this guy away. I want to, I want to put this guy in a little alien containment. I assume that's where he goes. Um, but I don't have one yet, so, uh, that's going to be a, that's going to be a task for later. So let me go ahead and research or scan this thing, the eye stocks. I don't know if that's anything I need or not, but we'll find out. So, here, here, here. food and water, maybe some food and water. I, think I have a nutrient block on me, but can't have too many orange sodas. You know what I'm talking about? All right, so, yes, I do have a nutrient block. Okay, let's head out. I'm going to go to the quarantine enforcement platform, I believe is what it's called. It's in this direction relatively, I think. <laughs> I say fully, fully knowing, knowing that my sense of direction is terrible, but no, I was basically right. It's right there. Okay, fantastic. Let's go. I don't know if we'll find anything interesting along the way. Do a little bit of exploring. We'll walk, we'll wander through the quarantine enforcement platform because I just haven't been in there, which I totally didn't even think about. I don't know how I managed to not go in there. We watched the sunbeam explosion and everything, and I just did not, did not think to actually go in there. Or if I did, maybe I was like, oh, I'll go in there later and then forgot. Both of those sound like me. So we'll get in there. We'll wander around. We'll explore the area around it. I'm never, I'm never totally sure what is around it. I know it can get kind of deep on some sides, and I know there's warpers around it, which is not my favorite. But yeah, whatever. We'll figure it out. We've got our, we've got our point defense system, perimeter, de perimeter defense, in case we need it. Pew! Neat. Sorry to any little fishies that I just torched. <laughs> I'm sure they're fine. They're fine. What's this? Is this anything? It's like a mobile vehicle bay. Uh, sorry. We're not... No, we're not near the other island. So I wonder what's down there. Have I been down there? Is that where the Degrassi... Degrassi? Is that where the Degrassi uh, habitat is? I don't know. Am I even close to the right way? Is it here? There we go. Fantastic. Am I close to the right way? Hello. Don't make me zap you. I'll zap you. Um, we've got the thing. We could go down to the, go down to the other entrance, but I don't think we're going to do that. Let's see. You've got the portal. I can't activate this, can I? That would be insane if you could. How would you, how, what would you, what would you even do to, to get that to happen? That'd be cool, though. Alien Arch, tell me about it. Something is undoubtedly gonna attack me from behind. Uh oh, it's a thing. Did I not have I not scanned an Alien Arch yet? Have I not found an Alien Arch? You guys leave me alone. More importantly, you leave my sea moth alone. Are you gonna Are you gonna attack my sea moth? You guys don't really attack much at all. I'm sure they do, but. They tend to not really attack me. They kind of just pull me out and then run away. 
that's exactly like the kind of thing that somebody would say right before they get killed by a warper. Um, is this a thing? That's not a thing. That's just a little piece of detail. Never know. You never know where there's secrets I've never found before. Okay, we're going to go in proper. Oh, we're not going to go in proper, are we? Because I'm a dummy and didn't bring anything with me. So I don't have a purple tablet. Of course I don't. Um, okay. And is there a per? Oh, I can't run with my flashlight? That is wild. Is there a purple tablet? I know there is one on the island, but is there another one? That's the question. And the answer is I don't know. So I'm going to look around here just because <laughs> if I can... Oh, that's so... It's so glowing. I didn't realize it was so glowing. Cute. Um, if I don't have to go back to the base, that'd be lovely. <laughs> you leave me alone. I don't want to ask you. I feel like there is another tablet in here somewhere. There's this, which is lovely and everything, but boy, I wish I could run with my flashlight on. <laughs> That'd be very helpful. Okay, I don't think, I don't think this is something I wanna do. I'm almost pot, I mean, well, I don't know about almost positive, but I don't know if there is another purple tablet. And if there is, I don't know where it is. So all the time I'm theoretically saving myself by not going back home might end up being a waste of time. But what else is new? <laughs> yeah, a little lithium. Pink caps, are those useful for anything? Oh, hi. Can I help you with something? That's what I thought. Pink caps, alien flora sample. Okay. Jail chunk, I don't care. I mean, I could break it, but I don't really care that much. None of these are things that I tremendously need, you know what I'm saying? I don't really need to be picking any of this stuff up. Salts, maybe? I mean, I don't know if I have a use for salt at this moment. Uh, water is not really an issue. I guess there's this. Oh, I could have brought some. Ow. 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 Eh. Eh. Could have brought some ion cubes with me, eh? Yeah, wait, do I have some? No. Uh, pink caps, speckled rattlers. I'll take these just for fun. Can I get seeds out of these? Sure can. Altogether too many. Oh my gosh. Stop it. <laughs> drop, 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 drop. I just need one. Thank you very much. Hello? Oh, <laughs> I was pushing myself around with the with my own seeds. Okay. Um This is the way I came? Question mark? No, this is the way I came. But I'm curious what's up here. Ooh, hi. These hit planets have names? Or moons or whatever they are? Are they the moons or is this the moon? Who knows? All right. Yeah, I'm not seeing another purple tablet. And there might be one, but instead of messing around in here for... Ages. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Never mind. We did it. <laughs> that was easier than I had planned. Okay. So, pff, now I'm lost. Hello? Oh. Uh. <laughs> How do I get back? This seems promising. Down, I think, is good. Right? Down tends to be good for getting back to where I want to be. I want to be in that way, direction, obviously. Um, hello? Hello? No, I'm not interested. Alright, well, this is outside. 
So, I'm just gonna go down here. <laughs> ah! Oh, jeez. Rude. That is the wrong way. Okay. Can you remember my Seamoth or Sea Glide State, please, game? So I don't have to set it every time I open up the game. What's this? Cyclops fragment? Seamoth? Scanner room? Nuclear reactor? Wait, I have the nuclear reactor, right? Never know. Oh, apparently I don't. Is that a Reaper? Get out of here. I want to ask you. Is it a Reaper or is it worse? Because I don't know. I don't, I'm not. I'm fairly certain I'm not near. Like the void or anything. Oh, yeah, it is a Reaper. Or wait, is it? It's not going to be like a ghost Leviathan, is it? Where'd you go? You just disappear into a cave? Alright. Probably shouldn't mess with that guy if I don't have to. Oh, I've scanned those already? If you say so. Okay, now I have a purple tablet. And we're we're ready to roll. Uh Go. And I scanned that purple tablet that was on the ground here, so I should be able to make purple tablets if I want to. So, there's that. Nice. Integrity. Please do. Tell me all about it. What's this? Unknown language. Attempting translation. Okay. Uh, alien data terminal. Discovered inside an alien facility, it was not possible to translate any useful information. However, scans have returned some information on the device itself. It's likely a solid-state computer, although there is no clear way to interface with it. On approach, it began producing a low-frequency radio wave containing complex but recognizable data patterns. Neato. Stuff, stuff, techno babble, stuff, stuff. I love it. Here's a, a doodad. We could power that teleporter if we wanted to. I don't know why we would want to. <laughs> I, don't, I don't see any need to be able to go back and forth between the islands, personally. I don't I don't plan to spend much time at these islands at all, necessary, let alone both of them. Okay, hit me. Uh, enforcement platform schematic. This data appears to be a multi-dimensional schematic of some kind. By mapping the pattern to three-dimensional space, it is possible to gather a basic understanding of this facility's internal workings. Uh, material. The material's unknown construction material. The facility's unknown construction material is identified defined as an ultra-hard, non-reactive metal amalgam. Cool. Uh, no indication that it could be damaged or destroyed by any means. Uh, harness the planet's natural thermal energy. Lovely. Yeah, 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 yada, yada, yada. Okay. I'm good. Pretty sure we just go this way. Wee! Ah! probability of interfacing with this facility is achieved by accessing the control room in the lower section. Let's go! Plop. We are now 93 meters underwater. And here's a little moon pool. So now that we've been here, I, I if I want to come back, I'll just park here. But easy enough to come in and out that way. But hello. Uh, let's see. Can I get anything interesting in here? I know we got some stuff that we can scan. An alien rifle. Well, what do we got? Alien rifle. Strong resemblance to human weaponry in form. This device must have been engineered with a hum humanoid user in mind. Whether the aliens that built this structure were themselves humanoid or otherwise employed the use of humanoids is unclear. What is clear is that they consider defending this facility a necessary precaution. There's no obvious way to remove the rifle from the case. Yeah, but that's an intact thing, isn't it? 
Like, how often have we synthesized blueprints from unintact things? I feel like... We could get the blueprint for that. You know what I'm saying? I don't need that rifle. Uh, Likely grown artificially. Grown, huh? Each cube contains the equivalent ionic energy of five kilotons of TNT. Fun. Likely used as batteries. I'm sure I can make something useful out of those. Okay. What else we got up here? Oh, another purple tablet. Don't mind if I do. Tablet. Small table. What are you? It's an alien device, and it does not like to be scanned very much. Or maybe it doesn't like me getting close. Doomsday device. Scans indicate this device contains enough potential energy to destroy the entire planet, along with most of the solar system. Fortunately, it has malfunctioned. I feel like that's unfortunate, isn't it? I feel like we'd want that thing to be functioning perfectly. <laughs> so I feel like a malfunctioning doomsday device might explode at any moment. Okay. Let's head in then. Can you imagine having to carry a bunch of those things around? You're an alien species and it's your job to come in here every day. And you've got to, like, lug around, like, a handful of these laptop size bits of metal. Just so you can get to work. Hello! What's up? Bah! You do Cool. I can't believe I haven't done this yet. <laughs> the control panel is broadcasting a message. Translation reads, uh -huh. Warning, infected individuals may not disable the weapon. This planet is under quarantine. Infected individuals may not disable the weapon. Infected individuals may not disable the weapon. Okay. Translating background broadcast. Downloading summary to data bank. This is the energy core. This device houses energy equivalent to a 100 megaton nuclear de detonation. It can be channeled through the facility and directed at vessels overhead, or bent around the planet's gravitational pull to strike targets in orbit. Wild. What was the other one? Research equipment? No. 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 Indigenous life forms? No. Blueprint? Yeah. What happened? I got... It gave me two, didn't it? I found an orange tablet? Where did I find an orange tablet? Oh, right. I went all the way down to crab squid territory. Thought it'd give me another thing, but I guess not. Nah. Right. Let's head out. Sure nothing weird will happen. I'm glad I did that. Because it's bananas that I hadn't. I just forgot that I hadn't. <laughs> but that should be the official title of this series. Subnautica out of order. How to do things wrong. But I don't mind. We got things. We got things. We got. We've got. We've been having stuff keeping us busy. We could go out the moon pool if I was so inclined, but I don't think it's I don't think it's particularly easier to get out that way than it is to get out this way. And this is where our sea moth is, so this is the way we're going. Hup, hup, hup. Nope. Doesn't have the doesn't have the ankles for that. Analysis of the yeah. on the walls cannot ascertain whether their purpose is aesthetic or functional. Okay. Further data required. That's okay. Thank you for the attempt. P 
PDA or whatever your name is. <laughs> Does the AI have a name? Cool. Okay. We did it. What's this? What is this? I don't remember this. Oh, more nuclear reactor fragments. Did this come from the, the sunbeam? Did the sunbeam drop stuff? I feel like it should have. Brain coral. Let's head down here real quick. I'm just curious. I don't really know what's down here. I don't... <laughs> I don't remember anything <laughs> from this game. <laughs> and I don't remember if there's anything interesting down here. Besides Reapers. Make sure our perimeter defense is activated. Don't need that at the moment. Yeah, kind of nothing. Uranium. I suppose at some point, maybe I should do nuclear reactors? I just don't know if that's going to be super necessary. All right. What are you? A propulsion cannon? At this depth? Is that a reaper? Oh, nope. It's bone sharks. Bone sharks fighting over me. There's plenty of sea moth to go around, boys. Stasis rifle, probably. Leave me alone. Oh. Oh, I thought that was a ruby. I was like, what, are you throwing rubies at me now? That's so cool. Ah! Hurting me a little bit. Sorry. Sorry, Seamoth. What are you guys doing? Get out of here. Ew. I zapped you. Oh, cool. Alright, I have no reason to be here. Let's get out of here. Oh, what's this? This is cool. Is there any way to get these things to float on the surface again? By adding floaters? That would be hilarious. You'd think they wouldn't need much help, right? Ooh, hello. I love this. Oh, that's terrifying. Gorgeous. Okay, hi. Um, I'm still on the lookout for arms, you know what I'm saying? Oh, get out of here. Can, do you guys mind? Why are you still chewing on me? What is, why are these guys so aggressive? Get out of here. Get. Dude, there's so many of them. I don't even have my... I don't even have my lights on. <laughs> Why are they so bothered by me? All right, I'm a little hungry. And consume, please. A little hungry, a little thirsty. So, all right, but let's take a look around in here. Hopefully those guys won't bother my sea moth. It's just chilling there. Please, please have arms, please. Please have arms, please. Please have arms, please. I just want... Uh, I just want prawn arms. Well, two prawn arms in particular. <laughs> I care less about the torpedo arm. Mainly because the prawn only has two arms. If I could put all three on there, I guess I would take the torpedoes, but... I just don't really use torpedoes. Maybe when I have eight billion bone sharks on me. <gasps> Here we go. What's this? That's just a regular arm. That's just a prawn suit. Oh, beans. Wait, wait, wait. No. <laughs> Rude. What are you? Oh. Oh, I didn't even know. I forgot this one existed. I'll take it. I just don't want it. I don't care. I don't care. That's not what I want. Data terminal. Hit me. Man, if there's gonna be arms anywhere, this should be here. What? 
don't get out of the prawn suit while it's moving? Is that what it's saying? Seems like sound advice, I suppose. Can you run yourself over? <laughs> oh no! Uh, oh boy, I'm glad I had a battery. What are you? Oh, beans. I'll grab it just because that'll sort of remind me that I did grab it. Oh, are you seriously not going to give me cool arms? This is like a Seamoth facility. Ah, oh, man. Ah, oh, man. This goes outside, doesn't it? Of course. <sighs> There's definitely something down there. Can I move this? Oh, of course I didn't bring my propulsion cannon. Why would I? Why would I want to have an easy time of it? <laughs> ah, nerds. Okay. This is all just prawn suit shenanigans. Man, I'm upset. What the, where does this go? More outside? Oh no, another place, okay. It's got potential, this is how I get out. Let me roll out real quick since I'm starting to get a little low on oxygen. <laughs> I just want the bone sharks to leave me alone. Leave me alone, bone jerks. Leave my leave my sea moth alone. I don't even care if they bother me. Uh, let's see here. Come on, come on. Well, I'll take these, I guess, since I can. This isn't what I wanted. Can I take this. No. Uh, nope. <laughs> Lovely. Can't go in there. That's just locked. Come on. Come on. Stasis rifle. I assume I have, but I actually can't remember. I do. Okay. Again, don't use it. But. Good to know. Eh, Alright. Man, this is a real bummer. <laughs> Red wart. Oh, <gasps> that's something. That's one of them. That's one of the ones I want. Yes, drill arm. <laughs> that's something at least. Ah, uh, I don't need that anymore. Now I just want the grappling arm. Ah, uh, it gets so much worse when there's only one you have to find. So I feel like, even though that doesn't necessarily make any sense, I feel like the odds have suddenly gone down a lot. That I'm gonna find it right. Because now it's. Now I'm not looking for two things, I'm only looking for one. <laughs> uh, uh. Well, I mean, there is technically a little place I haven't been in here. I don't know if I can get in without their propulsion arm. I guess I'm not even 100% sure I can get in with the propulsion arm. It definitely looks like there is an in, though, doesn't there? If I see a if I see a grapple arm, I'm gonna lose it. Unless wait, or no, this is where I was already. Oh yeah, this is where I can go. But doesn't this look like a place I can go? There definitely looks like there's stuff under there. Question is, is any of it good? And I mean, I don't know. I don't know if I can lift that. I don't know what the I don't know what the rules are for for prawn arm lifting. Or propulsion cannon lifting, rather. Uh, I feel like we should at least try. I don't know where the heck I am, though. Hi, guys. Oh, man. Oh, beans. Well, the drill arm was outside. Any chance that there could be a grappling arm lying around here? You guys leave me alone. No. No. I have a hot knife, and I'm not afraid to use it. What is this? Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> All 
right, what are you? Those are just smoke plumes? What is this? What am I looking at here? Oh, it's like dust falling. Oh, that's kind of cool. All right, where am I? No, you stop it. I'm just going to go sort of straight up from here. I'd like to come back. <laughs> but if you think I have beacons on me, you've never met me at all. Um, I'm curious where I am in relation to the island and the Aurora, my base. Okay, there's my base. So I'm about 1,200 kilometers from the base. Ow, stop it! And I'm almost exactly southwest, or northwest rather, of the Aurora. And almost exactly north of the base. So if I go essentially directly north from the base, about 1,280 kilometers, I should be essentially right over that. All right, we'll see. Don't make me I'll hit you again, boy. It's right. <laughs> anyway, let's head home. I'm gonna get myself the propulsion cannon because I'm just curious. I just want to see if there is anything in that little lower area. If I can even get to it, maybe it's just a little bit of a red herring, but it seems like I could probably pick that door up uh, if I had a propulsion cannon. So we'll give it a shot, and then hopefully, and maybe we'll look around a little bit more um, in that area once I have that. So, uh, but I think that's gonna have to do it for this episode. When I come back with more Subnautica, we'll, we'll, I'll, I'll, I'll go back to the base, I'll get my propulsion cannon, and then we'll head back to that wreckage if we can find it again. And, um, see if we can't find, see if we can't find that prawn gra uh, grapple arm. That's the one I really want. That's, that's when I feel like the prawn starts becoming a real useful tool. But anyway, uh, thank you so much for joining me, and I can't wait to see you again. Thanks for hanging out, and uh, have a good one. Okay, bye. Thank you again for watching the video. If you'd like to see more from me, feel free to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell if you want to be notified when my videos go live. I'd also very much love to hear from you down in the comments below.